All right, so today's the day, September 25th, 2021. We are finally gonna finish stripping that nasty red off this car and see what it's gonna look like, um, where we're gonna go from here. So not, not too terribly far to go. Got a nice cool day, a little breeze, so it'll be perfect for doing this. Here, I'm gonna get there and there, and I'll need to pull the rain tray so I can get that. Another thing that I was able to acquire for this, and I don't know if I've already posted it. Another video is I have a German, original German, 36 horse muffler, and then these two pipes right here to replace the rusted out sections. I guess they're all my NOS replacement pieces for the heater pipes, or that's just rotten. So I believe they're supposed to slip over back here, you know, cut it off, slip it over, clamp it, but I'm just gonna chop it wherever need be and uh, weld it up, grind it down so it looks all factory original. So sticking with you know, trying to keep it as original as possible um, to an extent anyway. So it will be a driver. So like anything else, you'll want to do a few updates, but definitely not sacrifice any of the originality. All right, let's get to stripping this paint. All right, so here we are. This is the next day. It's about noon today. I was out here from 11 to 8 last night. I stopped for dinner. I actually skipped lunch and all that. That's how long it took just to get those sections. I got all to about here done at that time. And then it's taken me another like three hours this morning just to get this. But this is what we're looking at here now. Everything's all exposed. It's crazy too, because I mean, you can see, you know, some brazing and stuff and there was lots of filler. But I mean, all of this that was just caked in filler, if you just primed it, I mean, there's a little spot down here, but with the exception of that and this work right here, there is absolutely no re reason to have any filler. It's like that here, this one, you know, same kind of thing, but they had filler on top of the paint all the way up here. And then, all of this, this, and every bit of this was filler, and there was nothing there. And you can see, it's straight. So, I stripped out the rest of the filler. It was here, just a tiny little door ding, which is expected. This one's kind of odd. You can kind of see how it crowns out here, and then it dips. It's kind of a weird dent, but... Should be able to metal finish that out and pretty much have that all gone. Got this all stripped. This fender, unfortunately, when I go to do the paint and stuff, I'll basically end up repainting the whole fender because there's so much of it gone. They had actually done the blue at one point for just, I mean, the most minor dings that would hardly even show up. Um, this lower section here they had repainted the blue once and then you know the red later on when this was done but there it is so now i just gotta clean it all up i'm gonna pressure wash it buff it i'm gonna treat all these bare metal sections so that they won't rust and i'll bring you back then in the last two days you definitely get a good glimpse of what she's gonna look like and it's not wet um, I did wash it but it's all dried off now just buffed it real quick threw a coat of wax on everything keep everything from surface rusting while it's 
being stored. Polish the hubcaps and buff the bumpers and all that kind of stuff. There is, you know, obviously some red here and there. Um, I'll be honest with you, I, I just had enough for now. This will definitely test your patience. She is looking good. So, the next thing I'm gonna do is see if she'll fire up. So that'll be the next video I post. Uh, hopefully it won't be too long. Hopefully in the next couple of weeks I will get a chance to do that and I will repost from there. But I wanted to give you guys a video update. I finally got a chance to get out here and spend a couple of days. And I was tired of looking at that red, to be honest with you. So, all right. Thanks for watching. If you like what you see, subscribe, hit that like button. I'd appreciate it. Thank you.